What's going on guys? My name is Sputnik. I'm Indy. And today, we're watching some more Steven Universe. This time, we're watching Season 5, Episodes 19 and 20. Alright, so we just had the most intense reveal of the show, I right. must say. It has to be. In the last episodes, and yes. that was some of my favorite episodes. It's just amazing storytelling going on there. Just the way it was depicted, and what we saw through um, Pearl's mind, yes. and her revealing it kind of subconsciously. That was amazing. Incred incredible storytelling going on in the show. I just, I can't process it at the time. I still can't even deal with how many, how much this shifts the whole paradigm of the show, of how I look at all the characters and everything now. Mm -hmm. And now I really want to know, does Garnet know? That's my question. I guess we'll get it revealed as we go forward. Or did she know? Because she seemed super um, surprised in the last episode, but we don't know for sure. Yeah, I think they're just surprised that Steven's aware, maybe? We don't yeah, know. Yeah, exactly. Uh, Ameth is definitely, it was like, what, what? the? Yeah. Yeah, she did not know. All right, well, going. we just want to hop into it. So before we start, y'all don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to support the channel, y'all. We're on the road to 5K right now, and we'd appreciate it if you supported us. If you want to go that extra mile, you can check out the Patreon, which is linked in the description below. So you can like one of these fantastic people listed here who support us over on Patreon. You guys are awesome, and you're seeing this earlier than everyone over here on YouTube. Um, yeah. So going into it, uh, we got two intense sounding episode titles, um, and I just can't wait to see how Steven processes this. This is, this is crazy. I, I'm not ready. <laughs> yeah, we're going into the final, yeah, just stretch of this show. That's the whole stretch for sure. I, I'm just ready to hop in and see how these characters act let's with this new paradigm shifting information in present. All right, let's do it, guys. And this episode is called Now We Are Only Falling Apart. And oh my goodness. Rose Quartz, uh, yeah. of the Crystal Gems. Amethyst is just Steven's as oblivious as Steven. Mm -hmm. was actually Big Diamond. Indeed. She faked her own shattering and reformed to be Rose all the time. That's Steven seeming like the adult explaining this shit. Was that no one could know. Mm. But now that Steven does. I can finally tell you. Is that how that works? Is that how a promise works? I mean, pink lion, a pink sword, and now pink diamond. Huh? If you told me Rose invented cotton candy, I believe it. Well, I'm sure there's a fan theory about that. Okay. No way. Okay, she didn't know. What? She. No. No. We're gonna. Oh my God. We get to see him again. Oh fuck. She held her hands. Looked us right in the eyes no. and told us to never question who we are as Garnet. Oh my we god. We questioned ourselves. Oh or man. Her. We couldn't well, Maybe have you should have? No. Fuck. You couldn't have known. This is a you reverse of roles here. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm for. Sapphire. Oh yeah. That future vision. To her. I trusted her. Ooh. I let her make fools of us all. No. Sapphire, it was out of right. love. I mean. But a lot of actions be out of love that can be hard. Oh no, we are not separating. I've never seen y'all not with each other. What? How our relationship is based on a lie? Fuck. Wow. Ruby, I'm so sorry. Come on, Pearl. It's worth lying to you about something that's true, which is that you are an experience and that you're valid. Oh my god. We'll go and get Sapphire. Okay. <laughs> I don't like this at all. I don't like seeing I don't blame. Like I mean, I I understand. Yeah, that that would. Shepard. Especially somebody that yeah, their future vision has always been pretty correct. She was right there all along, using us for her little war, smiling at us with those knowing eyes. You can me believe in a better future that I couldn't see. Fuck it me. And now here we are, our friends shattered. Oh, this is her um, fountain of roses. Of course she was a diamond. What a long road she took. To yeah, like this. that's really yeah, hard. I, I can... You no, know she didn't want anyone to there get There was some good stuff, too. It's so hard to realize there's good with I the bad. clearly don't know anything. Especially a, a deep you lie like that. Lying about your whole full being. I was being. given to Pink Diamond just a few thousand years before she was given so to So she her. was her diamond. I was I mean, supposed her to make her yeah. happy. I my just... Pearl. Never could. Oh my god. I can't process all this. We're getting flashbacks? What the fuck? Oh my god, she's beautiful. <laughs> I mean, we've seen her before. I know, but like, I'm getting to see her for more than like, a couple seconds. I could imagine it, if you would like me to, my diamond. 
She's like, can you be a like a person and not just show me the status of the prime kindergarten? Yes, my diamond. She's like, you can knock off all that <laughs> shit with me. The first court soldiers are due to emerge soon. Oh man. <gasps> oh, finally, something exciting. Yeah. Life Hurry, is exciting. we gotta see this. Quickly. She's a little life. different from how we saw her in the I don't want my own Look planet. At this pearl. Oh yes, but creating life. I guess because she got what you wanted here. Not from nothing. You're stealing it from the Welcome earth. Welcome to Earth. Yeah, oh, she wanted to get down there in the good stuff. Mm -hmm. So this is what uh, Sapphire was kind of in. I'll have us warped into the kindergarten at once, my diamond. W what? You can no, do that? No, if I went down to the kindergarten, I would never hear the end of it from yellow and blue. Yeah. Oh, but could you, you could if you pretended me to be down one there of them. laughing and playing with the amethyst? Yeah. Of course I can, my diamond. You look so happy. Mm -hmm. I won't be so happy when blue and yellow find out. Oh my God! This, I gotta have. I have so much to say about this. Because you look just like a quartz. You this changed your shape for a day. That's brilliant, oh Pearl. God. I'm glad I was able to help my die. <laughs> Down here. Oh Pearl, look. <laughs> this is incredible. Yeah, there's no she star eyes. Oh. Not her, she's like a, speaking of Captain Underpants, I don't know, the way she leaves her around reminds me of him. <laughs> this is so out of my way. <laughs> oh yeah, now you get to get hurt I'm like so a person sorry. too. These amethyst I keep saying person. So I guess gem person. Pearl, don't you human. see what's happening? Huh? We're actually here, and I am fitting right in. I don't know about that. Yeah, yeah, you're... Absolute. Thank you so much for talking me into this. I couldn't have done this on my own. Uh, uh you're welcome, my dad. She's a cool boss. Yeah, shh, Pearl, you're gonna get us in trouble. Sorry, my quartz. <laughs> <laughs> hey, fellow amethyst. Quartz. <laughs> Yeah, so what they're all amethysts. All the... There's two more from our unit that haven't emerged yet, so we're gonna go <laughs> oh, for them. Wow. Oh, here comes one of them. This is uh, historic. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love how they. Oh, so yeah, she voices all of them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, everyone's talked about that before, nice or I've seen multiple comments. Ever said so we've never seen a rose quartz on then. Here. Only our in orders were to move Shadow. out as soon as you emerged. But 8XM hasn't emerged yet. Wait she around can for catch her. up with us later. Go, go, Much go. later. And she never did. Oh, I guess she did. Once you saw them at the. <laughs> Let's not draw any more attention to ourselves than we already have. Oh, you're right. But things were getting really fun. What if we took some time to explore some of Earth's other features? <gasps> Pearl. It's crazy that Pearl even sounds younger in this. The voice actor is. Just so she I don't know. Out she just sounds so more. Well, that's how it started. Doesn't have she a huge more load like... of stress on her really? like she does now. So oh God, I love Pearl. This... I'm sorry this if I was ever earth. mean to you. We didn't understand a lot of her character. And this is just a small portion of the resources available for making gems on this planet. I have to see it all. Yeah, it's not resources. This is this is the fun stuff. You don't gotta change it and turn it into Oh. Oh my god. This is Rose <sighs> God, she's so complicated. Yeah. I don't know how to process this. She's a kid, but she acts like a kid, but she has so much responsibility and weight and has effect on people. Are these indigenous American people? I mean, yeah, this is... In America, we saw it on the little map. Is everything all right, my diamond? Oh, you curly. seem troubled. All this life that's been growing wild here on Earth, none of it will survive my invasion. Yeah, we saw We're not in Jungle Moon what happens when with the We're taking destroyed planets. And leaving nothing behind. Yeah. Forgive me, my diamond. I shouldn't have brought you to such a place. I shouldn't no. have challenged your ego. I needed to see this. So she did want to protect Earth. She didn't realize what the colony was doing to the planet. Mm -hmm. So what? She suddenly started to care about Earth? Why did she have to rope us into all this? Why couldn't she just stop the colonization herself? Well, she tried. Uh, she when she like told the, the other diamonds, she didn't yeah. want to go through with the colony. Yep. They told her to finish what she started. 
And she told the other diamonds so she wanted to around. preserve life on it's Earth. It's like when Rose was pleading with Pink Diamond in that flashback of episode. humans in. Was, she did it. everything she could as Pink Diamond, but her status meant nothing to Blue. Ooh, I thought you were cool. Really? She Just because she cries? Yes. Someone <laughs> they couldn't ignore. She was yeah. going to scare every gem off the planet, but everything changed when she saw your fusion. Yeah. Oh man. Oh, this mm. changes everything. I can't process it. Only on Earth, this. don't you think? Only on Earth where anything can happen. Yeah. A fusion of two completely different gems. Definitely. Can all gems do that? How have I never heard of this? I've only ever heard she, even that she didn't realize it was a thing. Can you imagine what that must feel like? I love oh. Fusion. <laughs> Pearl said immediately. Yes. I literally was just rewatching. And Pearl is strong. Holy shit. Oh. I thought, if a ruby and a yes, sapphire, but gonna... you're a diamond. Forgive me. What am I doing? I, I no. need to be oh replaced my God. Pearl has been through so no. much, bro. But I've been imagining things. It's like she's you know, finally letting her emotions too. come out. I for like the first time in her pearl, little and pearl life. here on Earth. A rose quartz. And I'm not yours, but I make you so happy anyway. Whoa. Isn't that ridiculous? <laughs> Tell me to stop. Aww. Please don't ever stop. <laughs> Let those emotions out. Yeah, we haven't seen you since oh. season two. Oh, for a second. That scared this them. This is very not allowed. <laughs> <laughs> that fusion. Oh, this we never it. should have left her there with blue. But giving very much a first queer a like experience. Oh, right, and then you'd be like, oh, we shouldn't have done that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Ouch. Ah! We wow, so that was this. right in between. Well, well, we did this this is crazy. I said fused. this like ten times we'll already. No, no, please. I'm glad to see you again. Golly. Before Garnet, Rose was only fighting for Earth. But Garnet changed everything. Damn. Rose wanted to fight for her. She wanted to fight for gems. And maybe she was foolish and maybe even De selfish. Definitely selfish. But she was following us. What? This whole time we thought we were following her, but Damn, that's she was following us. Kind of beautiful. How could she not after you swept her off her feet? <laughs> Literally. What? Me? Are you kidding? You took her on this whirlwind tour of Earth and then she wanted to live here with you forever. That's just how I felt when I came here with... Oh my Ruby. god. Oh no! We have to get back right away! <sighs> Ruby? It's okay I'm to so have some sorry. time to yourself. Where are... Huh? Well, let's hope Ruby has them. Oh, oh no. no. Oh no. Oh no! Oh my <laughs> fucking god! I was like, all right, now we can have our reunification. Um, so this is the best show ever. Okay, that is very evident to me. God, I I, I just put in my back of my head when you're like, oh, you guys are gonna be able to handle the reveals later in the show, and I'd forgotten about it basically. So now with this paradigm shifting information, it's like, and now I get so much more like back information that is like that I'm going back and having to reevaluate everything just with them like. Filling in gaps in between what happened, we got, you know, just in the answer, you know, in that episode, obviously, um, Rose Quartz meeting Garnet and teaching her. But, yeah, this is all so beautiful. That's very interesting. Indeed. So, in uh, our reaction to, um, I think, yeah, the episode where they uh, finished the cluster or where they, you know, dealt with the cluster or whatever, I said once in the in the reaction or whatever someone co commented on one thing i said in my rational when i was like the kind of cluster thing gave me like the vibe of like um like the idea i said of like uh the god or whatever created the universe coming down it to be like a part of the experience or something like that and someone was like yeah the show was a lot about that or like it has tones of that now i'm like i see that idea represented in like rose is literally um re being a god in forms or whatever, being the most powerful, one of the group of the most powerful beings, and then coming down to Earth, to, like, a planet, to become, like, those being, <laughs> the beings or whatever, and actually learning through the experience and being molded by it and shaped and being, like... So Rose is Jesus. Is <laughs> I was saying, Rose is Jesus. <laughs> Rose is, um... Uh, yeah. Uh, it's just so beautiful. It, it's beautiful how complex every single character in this show is. Like, they've all... Hit the gamut, but none of them beat Rose Quartz. I, let me tell you, no, nothing beats her level of um, complexity. I want to just be able to put her in one shade of gray and or black and white, I should say, and just be like, she's awful for what you did or whatever. 
And just seeing how she was growing and changing, like, she was ready to put herself off completely by an earth, and then she saw Garnet, and she's like, oh, so I care about the um, people on earth, or I care about the um, gems as well, too, you know? She was just constantly changing, and I think that's something I can do a lot as a person. I can, like, put, like, someone I view in a leadership role as, like, shouldn't they know, like, everything? Like, you're, you're the one in charge. Like, I thought you were no. leading us, and... We're all just beings trying to get, growing and changing, trying to get the A to, from A to B um, while growing and changing along the way. And our direction changes a lot. B changes a lot. Ugh. Last thing I'll say is, like, it, I, I was thinking a lot about also the episode that I had the most conflict with or whatever, which was when they were, like, test the test, I believe it's called, where they were testing Steven or whatever, and in the end he finds out that... Um, um, Garnet didn't, or not Garnet. Yeah, the the gems or whatever. Um, Ward didn't have as much of a. Oh yeah, he could. Is that he couldn't fail the test or whatever. Like and and at the end he realized how much. Yeah, how much they weren't all knowing characters and really just trying to figure things out just like him. And I feel like that is a, a theme that's also being reintroduced here. Yeah. Um, I spoke a ton. How do you feel? No, um, I, it, it's all very complicated. Um, I mean, like, I now we've got all the simple, thing, but... Anything is that it is very complicated. Yeah, like... And, I mean, I guess, like Pearl said, like, you can still say that some of her actions were selfish, you know? Like, you can say things like that and still acknowledge that, like, well, she believed she had good intentions. Yes. You know, so... Following your heart can be a very self-centered, um drive but it also can be one of the most true things someone can do true to them I mean, whether... see the thing is but like not that like that's wrong because i agree but um i i do think the way that you follow your heart and involve other people in whatever your intentions are that's where it's like where the gray areas come in because being true to yourself and following your heart like of course like that is the most authentic way you can live your life mm -hmm. but our actions do have consequences and impacts on other people. So most it's definitely, especially if you come from the together. most privileged group in the universe. It, exactly, or like like it, 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 I say, I review her as childish because she's like just so far removed from like yeah. It took her going down there for like a day to realize oh these are things and living beings that I should care about, and all the diamonds still don't have that element. So if you are a godlike being, you must go down. For one day to be like one of the us commoners or whatever we joke but that's literally very much is like a present thing in the world where like there's so much disparity and wealth and power in our current world like yeah it, it, it's hard to view it as to as much like kind of rose colored glasses um when we see like the real impact that that's had um of like people playing god and other people literally her touching down in north america like there's so many real historical parallels that we can get into yep she is complex i think that was the first thing one of the first spoilers someone ever gave me for the show that really pissed me off i saw a comment someone was like oh man i, I, I hated that rose ended up sucking or something like that and that was way back in like season two or something and i was like what are we talking about Why are you... the thing is like i think people have still different Oh yeah, totally. Yeah. But I'm like, but yeah, just giving me that that level of complexity to your character when that early on, I'm like, it tainted me looking forward a little bit at it. But even now, I'm like, I can see the complexity, and yeah. that's always good to see. Yeah. And hopefully, oh god, she got that breakup note. <laughs> she got that breakup note. So I guess we're gonna see. I mean, she she did initiate it. Yeah. So I, I, I can if you're see gonna be a lash rash or whatever, I'm um, expect it, Ruby to um, have some of that needing time to be like, is this even what I want to do, too? Yeah. They spent so much time as Garnet. Fuck, they didn't even think to think. Is that how we have to spend all the time? <laughs> I, 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 last thing I'll say, my favorite phrase. Um, I hate that, that now that I have to deal with so many um, presumptions I made with every bit of this show. Like, I'm just ripped, they're, they're all being ripped up uh, of, like, just ways of doing thing. Like, of course Garnet would want to be, you know, she loves being a, a fusion and, and experience so much. 
and it's also beautiful for me to realize how just unique she is in the universe for like especially when how it was used viewed as bad for um fusions of different um gems you know yeah god I'm, i love this show i'm sorry i'll talk forever but we gotta keep it moving so let's what do you say we head on to the next episode let's do it yo next one this episode is called what's your problem oh lord ruby what is ruby's problem i'm so sorry where are huh <laughs> i love the <laughs> sapphire oh no where did everyone sapphire. else go you were right Marco. i need some time to think so I'm running away. Oh, not from Ruby. everybody, Ruby. This can't be happening. Oh, Ruby. I'm so sorry. You left before I could a take back all the horrible things I said to you. Did she say horrible things? Well, she's Amethyst just upset. Her, yeah. right? Maybe she knows where she went. Amethyst. Damn it, Amethyst. Ruby? Yeah, I seen her. <laughs> uh, she asked me for a pen and paper a while ago. Oh, Lord. Why? Because she ran away. Yikes. Did you see where she went? I don't know. Maybe she'll come back. This is Amethyst. not the time for I know, like, slacking. I really... Hey, Steven. Get over here. I need Amethyst. a player, too. I, I, and I guess that she doesn't really see the implications see behind Rose being a diamond software? and all of that. Oh. I guess. Oh. Yeah. So to her, she's just like, oh, she's wow, that's crazy. Rose, from, is, yeah. Rose is just so cool, huh? And then just kind of moved it's on. Like, she's not understanding. I have no idea what she could why would she be a cowboy? What? <laughs> oh, she's in future vision. That's She's okay. Going to be okay. okay. She's going to come back. She's got to come back. If she doesn't, then then there would be no more Garnet. And what on earth would we yeah. do without Garnet? Let's not freak out, Pearl. Oh, Pearl. <laughs> How will I ever get her back? I yeah. I don't know. I like the <laughs> sapphire, but I much prefer Garnet. It can't be over. <laughs> I have a very special place in my heart for Sapphire, though. We love a cold. Why don't you do dig all of this into the Except temple? very lovable. <sighs> Steven and I are going to play some video games. No, no, it's okay. Don't worry, Sapphire. I'm going to go out and find Ruby. What? I'll be right back with her in no time. All right, Steven. As long as you're using some powers. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> I love Craig for <laughs> Okay, good. let's make you. She's only doing it because watching them cry makes her uncomfortable. Of All right, they're showing us the fucking full space of the. Away, not warping away. And I know we're gonna see that fusion well. in this show, y'all. We just need to figure out of which direction she ran. House. So Statue. how do we do that? Uh, let's try putting ourselves in Ruby's shoes. Oh God. <laughs> now what? Uh, Amethyst, be serious. No, this can help. This is a visualization. Gone in one of two directions. Either into town or into Steven the is being so mature throughout this, I must say, again. So proud of him. Ruby! He shouldn't have to be the Ruby. most, like, strong and together one. I guess he is technically a okay, so diamond god underwater. being. Ruby! But he Ruby. Doesn't, doesn't think like one. Ruby? I really don't think she's hiding under a seashell. Maybe Ruby shapeshifted really small! I'm saying it's like this. You never know. I'll keep it. I'll keep it. <laughs> you know I love these great goofs, but I'm yeah, she's about Ruby. um using. Can you stop messing around and turn back to normal? What, what do you call yeah, when you be eyes. funny to avoid? You destroyed the house to not to deal with emotions and things. Or maybe she's she's just, maybe she might be using humor to cope, or maybe she knows. She knows that she doesn't feel doesn't a type of way. Like she's clearly, here. everyone else does. Get so in, she's huh? like, I'm not sure how to we handle that. We just gotta keep yeah. looking. Oh, a little sad face. You got the artist approval and the tots. Where are those the bits? <laughs> That'd be way too close to even be bugged at all. Hey. What is Cause how does he know? I mean, yeah. He has a sixth sense. She's not in here either. This is where I'd go if I was feeling down. Pizza always cheers Best me pizza up. pizza in Beach City. So well, to be fair. <laughs> but we haven't and the Ruby only pizza yet. here. Steven, it's cool you want to help Ruby, but what about you? Yes. Come on! Let's forget about Ruby for a moment and get some pizza! Not necessarily that pretense, but Steven does yeah. need to have time for himself. Maybe and I'm a little hungry. 
Who needs, of course. Here's your pizza with literally. Is this the first time we've seen a fish toppings. stew pizza? Yeah. Well, that's because it's all the toppings for her. Okay. Oh, Versus like. Here. You're gonna just need these. Flat pizza yeah. Thanks. Ones with yeah, thanks, man. You're welcome. How do you even attack that? So. Let's fold some slices. Pink diamond, huh? Yeah. yeah. How do we feel about this? Hot. Rose quartz, eh? <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. So, all this time, we thought Rose was this rebel leader. Yeah, Steven is surprisingly composed. She's just rebelling against herself? Yeah. Apparently. I love that. <laughs> and the diamond that Rose supposedly shattered. She literally destroyed. You got it. Her it's right there under half her shirt. perception of herself. Yeah. So, how you feeling? He's I feel way more mature than I could ever be in this situation. I, I thought I'd, I'd really finally got it. That mom didn't have everything figured out, even though everyone put her way up on this pedestal. But now I guess she's royalty too? Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'm relieved that she didn't shatter anyone, but she lied to everyone. I mean, I'm not surprised. I knew she was a liar. This Fuck. is just so much. This yeah, Steven. Yeah. But like, aren't you mad? Kind of? I don't know. I can see how she was good and bad and bad and good, but now they make it itself right a little bit more. It it. <laughs> but what about you? She's your mom. You were always under all this pressure to be like her. But was she even like her? Was anyone there we go. like her? There we go, Anna She was face. supposed to be so great. She was supposed to know everything. Damn. She was supposed to make everything better. It's not fair. We shouldn't have to deal with any of this. There we, we shouldn't go. have to fix any of this. Right. No, we this is Bria Warm Motions. War. This, this is everyone else's problem. No. This has nothing to do with me. Oh, God. I feel you, Amy. God. And you, th this has nothing to do with you. <laughs> yeah, you, you wanted to talk to her, uh, to okay. him, huh? No! I mean, yes! Of course I'm okay! Ugh, I'm trying to find out how you feel about all this. She, your mom okay? Yes, doesn't it really does. affect me. Yeah, stop acting like a hard ass, all right? Dude, Kiki, I just got the biggest tip from Mr. Universe, and I'm totally going to buy those boots now. I'm glad Whoa, Mr. Universe is a good Seriously? Teacher. Yeah, he was like all the way out on Brooding Hill, which is totally out of our delivery oh, radius, with Ruby? comforting some little friend. Oh. She must have been crying because she was like, Super really? Rad. Rad. <laughs> yeah. Ruby, let me handle this, Steven. How is she going to be no a cowboy? Don't you <laughs> anything else on you. Just let someone else take care of it for once. Nah, she wants to co wait. confront There's someone some else issue. who needs help even more, and yeah. it's you. Amethyst, we need to talk. Yeah, I'm gonna run for my every copter. She made herself busy. Let me help you with your mail. Yeah, I'll super jump, of course. Get off my back, dude. <laughs> Quite literally. <laughs> Come on, you can go. Don't freaking break her. <laughs> I mean, I guess it's relatable because Steven has less presumptions about Rose Quartz than someone that actually lived and dealt with her day. Of course, I'm. Oh <laughs> god, they're going to all the clouds so here. Dude, you're literally inside my head. Amethyst, look out! Just turn into not that. <laughs> yeah, a parachute. Does that make you fail? Oh my god. Hey, Amethyst? It is a flatterization, but this episode is like their character what attributes heightened to the Steven? most level, which I, I love. I was pretty clear about that. I thought I was pretty clear too. I feel like I don't want to say what about me, okay? And I don't want to be bent out of shape. I don't want to be stuck in the past. And I'm not responsible for what Rose did. None of us are. Not you, not Pearl, and not Garnet. But you still got to deal with it. I am responsible for me. And right now, no I am gem not going to dump island. another thousand year old complex on you or anybody else. I'm ending it right here. Oh, damn. I am the Ding dong, sunshine future. Your friend forever. And I'm not gonna fall apart on you. Amethyst. So, Steven, how do you feel? I love you, girl. Pretty good. Good. Everyone deserves to be able to fall apart a little, though. 
And she did. Yeah. In her own image. Have you been trying to cheer me up this whole time? Yes. She didn't geez. become hermit crab for nothing. Don't yes. you know you deserve hermit gem. It? That was an amazing visual. Her as small as just to be her gem. <sighs> I guess we're not finding Ruby this way. Amethyst? What? I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I think you're officially the most mature crystal gem. Ooh, what a thought. Oh, no. <laughs> Gross, that's what this is, isn't it? Yeah, yeah pretty much. No! <laughs> <laughs> Turn it to baby! Turn it to baby! <laughs> what you still want to find Ruby? Hell yeah. yeah. Alright, let's go. Oh, yeah. They finished that pizza. They just love that damn pizza there. Right? All those <laughs> Playing with As if she food. couldn't have just. Oh, but I need to have a tampon. Or you would have wasted it. Let's go in for a little look out. Peek. Okay. Okay, that's the well, At least we know, where, we know where she is. Yeah. And she's with uh, yeah, a friend. <laughs> Mr. Universe. Maybe his money can solve all of Ruby's problems. It can solve mine. Mm -hmm. Exactly, Greg. <laughs> I'll give you our uh, contact info. <laughs> oh my goodness! Yeah, so we got one episode fully about a uh, um a sapphire dealing with it, and then one about. Uh, well, I guess we'll get one. Yeah. A little more specific, yeah, and then Ruby. they'll. Yeah. Okay. Um, um, Hopefully she ends up being a cowboy, though. I, 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 I would love to see it. She'd yeah. be a great cowboy. Yeah, maybe I, I something to do with his album concept or something that Greg's working on. Mm -hmm. so. Well, gosh, mm -hmm. I'm, now I'm, yeah, I'm just really excited is sort of the wrong word, but to see how, you know, Ruby's processing all of this. Definitely. Ah. And... Uh, I, I'm thinking about how I'm processing it. I barely can deal with these carrot all these characters. Like, um, Amethyst being the most mature wasn't on my bingo list, but it's completely um, consistent and true to her characters. How she ended up being this way, because um, I I was saying it earlier in that reaction, I'm like, is this her just not emotional bypassing or whatever, but like emotional, just compartmentalizing by Good using word. the humor. And I think that there's an element of it there, but it's also an insistence that she not be her acknowledging how much this affects steven he's literally <laughs> the pink diamond that's yeah. literally in case it is his body like it is him part of him i saw him whatever y'all always wait until it happens to me and when we, all, when we end up watching the um shorts i'm sure there, there's like some about like you know the logistics and all that stuff we and you've never seen the shorts right yeah so that'll be fun we'll probably do that towards i think we'll do that right before we finish the series um just okay. like a cool little um thing to slide in there um, but yeah, um, Amethyst, yeah, just acknowledging how much this affects Steven and me, like, I'm not gonna fall apart on you, but I'm, I'm gonna, some, there needs to be, some consistency there, they left, um, what's, um, yeah, Sapphire and Pearl, they're in a puddle. <laughs> and then that's okay, because they, they also need to reprocess some things, and I know Pearl's, you know, feeling nervous about the idea of not having Garnet with her, and Sapphire is potentially sad about not being Garnet. So, yeah, I was a scary thought. Indeed, yeah, I was editing that pool hopping um, episode um, today, and it's really got me realizing Garnet never, um, it, it was never even uh, in her future vision that um, Rose was being diamond, which is insane to me. Because she, if well, because... that was ever even a factor, she wouldn't have been as just put together and as. <laughs> And, you know, yeah, as Garnet, as we, uh, you know, predicted, you know? I mean, she has future vision, not past vision. Yeah, but the revelation, that'd be in the future. So Stephen revealing it was so out of, uh, yeah, it was in a whole different pool of reality. Yeah, that's, that's what, what I'm, that whole episode yeah. emphasized. Yeah, I'm saying, but yeah. So if she never predicted that, season, yeah, because she, she was talking about telling him, "Hey, you know, you're acting so uh, wacky and crazy. You're going, hopping into whole new pools and dimensions." Yeah, she, yeah, I'm saying, yeah, yeah. She she acknowledged that. Yeah, yeah. yeah so Stephen was the factor there. Yeah. So I'm just saying, yeah, it just made me realize, yeah, like the, the, that how much Stephen his own agency. It was him going after Lapis. His relationship with Lapis at the bottom up to the moon, where he had that 
dream vision that made him want to confer, confront Pearl. He's a very active protagonist, which I love. You know, he's made this future. Like, there's a whole future uh, alternate timeline of the show where we never even got this reveal. It's not like Pearl would, like, die before, because two gems die. Oh, I, I don't even know if that's confirmed. <laughs> like, uh, over old age. So, but I guess Pearl would have kept that secret for... Who knows? I think she said it's... You can still, like, get... I don't know. Yeah. Of old age is, like... I don't know, because do they, like age like that for real exactly i don't get it. like they just kind of exist in the same think, state over time. i guess once your universe falls apart <laughs> yeah honestly i mean like because like when you think about it, like think about actual like life. rocks and gems like it only happens over time erosion things like that over time shattering like that's the only way it would die yeah. they're not really in <clears throat> in our universe i know people talk about like the heat death of the universe and everything does that mean every physical like planet comes apart too as well I don't know that far in the future of <laughs> predictions yeah, for right. how our universe dies. Because I know the universe eventually does um, become eventually, like, dead. Um, and also, like, will they be living after all the suns die out? I'm sure they'd have technology to make their own suns. You know. I mean, because they, they, literally when you were, when we saw them on Homeworld and stuff, they live in a spot that doesn't really, isn't surrounded by a big star or anything like that. They're yeah, just kind of in the middle so of maybe. nowhere. So. Who knows? Yeah. Gems effectively could live forever. Is what I'm thinking. But yeah, it's just crazy that, yeah, this whole new revelation is upon us now. And I, um, I can't process it because I'm sure it's even, yeah. Uh, it's also some comments. There are some people talking about how, like, Steven hasn't really had time to process And I'm sure as we get into the future, maybe that'll be the time when he, like, processes all this. Like, what has happened? I'm guessing future is like kind of a calm after the storm type of vibe. I don't know. I really don't. Know. I don't know anything about it. So indeed. Um. Well, y'all. Thank you so much for watching <laughs> this pair of episodes with us. It probably would have been a good three year, but we don't got that time today. So this is. I feel like this. I, I'd like to think that. Are, I think the two next two pair. probably go together. That's well, which is always good. Then because right. we didn't get a title on this one. I'm meaning um the, yeah, the intro. Yeah. So, so I yeah, figure this is like a good. Yeah. Totally. Sense. Yeah. So, yeah. What's your problem, dude? Um, and yeah, just there was like them feel? genuine. Like, I guess the title was like them all gen or genuinely asking yeah. you to like, what is your problem? How are you feeling? Like, what what is the issue happening right now? Yeah. Yeah, it's good to see. I don't know. It still feels weird that Steven is just so like. Again, it is this that uh, his removal from his mom has always been a concept in his whole head his whole life. So he doesn't have the huge emotions that would come with like the others of having known or having followed her for your whole life as Garnet. Like, yeah. Yeah. Forget that Garnet was literally born through her relationship to Pink Diamond and that day. Yeah, that that is if anything is caused for you to rethink your whole life, that is. So I Yeah, that. absolutely. Like you truly like only are the way you are because someone encouraged you and you thought like i don't know yeah you just thought they they knew better mm. i don't know i think that's it's a, it's a bit of a betrayal i like i don't i don't fault her mm. but i think that's the biggest discomfort of me of you know being an aging person myself or whatever realizing damn so none of y'all had this thing figured out before me <laughs> like i'm sure like there's one person that like had a really good grasp I'm like no everyone was a human and they all exactly. very much had their own ills and uh, warts and all and it's kind of beautiful to me also realizing that every single person i ever looked up to was just a human or a gem or whatever but it's it's you know it's freeing and i think that's how steven's been able to be so free with this it's like oh my mom was a gem not a I, I'm not a, but yeah, this, I don't know, yeah, she wasn't, like, this larger than life thing, she was very much uh, part of this. Well, that's not fair to say, because she literally was. <laughs> sure, she was still smaller than all the other diamonds, but yeah, um, yeah, yeah she is, like, a, oh, I'm saying, they're, like, a, effectively gods, that's uh, one thing I hope that will be answered, maybe in the show, if not in the show, then in future, like, the origins of guess it was just the evolution for them too i don't think they would go anything too crazy of where all the diamonds come from or but maybe it could be like a adventure time where like the mother gum was bonnabelle <laughs> they could be the mother gem and all other gems were spawned from the well. primordial gems <laughs> who knows uh, <laughs> who knows <laughs> no, not, me. <laughs> not me not me either but i do know i love this show y'all we are in 
whole different pool now. We, we've hopped into a whole different pool, and I don't know how this uh, this episode is going to end. Or this show is going to end. Man, I know how this episode ended. <laughs> Not this show. But I enjoy you for coming along. I enjoy um, Indy for, you know, watching this with me. It took a little while to get started on this reaction, but it was definitely worth the watch. Um, so thank you. Um, thank you all for watching all. What's next? <laughs>